Hello, this is story time. I just have to say some stuff. I want to get off my conscience. Yeah. Anyway, my perpetrator, whatever you call him, as far as I'm concerned, is a pervert. I'll say P. Perp perpetrator P. Pervert. It's a prevert. Prevert, pervert. So I'll just use the letter P. Okay, what's his name? He be bugging me. His name is Alfonso. He's from the Long Island, New York region. And I don't know, he's been doing this. He's about 63. He sh yeah, he said, I think, 63 years old. He's been doing this since he was in his 20s. So that's like 40-some years he's been doing this stuff. Well, he's obsessed with annoying me. I don't know why. Uh, hopefully he got fired. So I'm just saying this. So all those who know who he is, you guys can get him fired. Time to him to get off his job. He should retire anyway. He's 63. It's a long time he's been harassing people. And then, even if I go to other cities or other countries, he's always there. And then he teaches the new people what to do. And he uses my body as a, um, uh, you know, as a, I don't know, teaching. And he teaches them what to do. He teaches them how to use the technology. Because I be hearing them sometimes. That's what he does. You know, it's my body and my vagina. And, you know, what the hell are you teaching these people? He didn't advance in his career at all. He's just a teacher. Now he's a teacher. Before he was just a regular worker. I don't know. But now I know he teaches people because he's always showing the, new, the newbies on my body what to do. Because I hear him. Yeah. But, oh, his claim to fame, far as I know what he said, he has something to do with the World Trade Center. I don't know. But... Yeah, I have to say that. That's why I want to get off my conscience. Because all those people that I, his people in the New York region over there at that time, they orchestrated that to, to blame Muslim people for that. And they didn't really do that. It was because of these P-peoples who, who did that. And that's not right to be blaming a, a group of people for something that they didn't do. Like in the book, the 1984, they had those... Um, people that they were blaming and it wasn't real it's all made up well same thing here they made up against the muslim people because they really didn't do it i'm sorry i have to say that it was these perps who had been doing this and now we all know there's perps going on these targeting people like that and they made them look and they killed all them people i don't like how they killed all those people on the plane and then now today fast forward um 2019 they had the um ethiopian airlines plane and it just went up in the air and they someone one of them perps people they did that they zapped it you know that plane won't be going and crashing like that it was a new plane they did it they back in the days they used to used to they did did it that way with the world trade said now they don't even now they got um software that just zaps the plane and everybody's dead so i don't like what's going on so i have to say what i have to say so his name is alfonso he's a 63 years old italian american guy he's in the new york region but he follows me everywhere i go He's still right here. Well, he's right around. Yeah, he's still here. Not where am I? Don't matter where I go. I go any country. He's always following me, and he teaches the locals there what to do. He calls me his favorite guinea pig. That's what he thinks of me. His guinea pig. And I want to say something about my family. I think he was responsible for my mom's and father's death. Yeah, cause he told me he was tired of him anyway. He wanted to be have me all to himself because you know i would help him out and stuff so i can't prove it but that's what he told me i believe him because they was kind of messed up anyway that's all i just have to say he's not a nice person and he never will be and i'm just tired oh another thing he likes to be saying i'm his wife and he calls me his wife his code word for me is wife i don't have no desire for this man i don't even know what he looks like but i know he always talks now and again I hope he gets fired. So all you, oh, one of his catchphrases is Christ. Every time he, something happens, he always says Christ. So if someone knows this man named Alfonso, who you always say Christ all the time, that's him. I don't know who he is, but that's all I have to say. So if you know your per P people, get on the YouTube and just give us some little information about them. And if we, you know, we could, you know, just share it. So I'm just sharing what I'm going to have to say. I'm tired of this man, but I hope he gets fired soon. Or retire or something because I'm tired of his crap. Have a nice day.